Hello my friends, and I'm here today with a very seasonal video. I'm so excited. It's been disgustingly hot in Tokyo, like disgustingly hot. And then for the past two days, suddenly, all of a sudden, it's a manageable temperature. I'm finally able to fully live my life and do things outside. And with that, I decided that I'm gonna do a little bit of a autumn style outfit video. How exciting. Before that, I just wanna say a few things. First of all, I have a you now now. If you don't know, I do live streams on you now. The reason I choose you now is because I'm able to like actually invite one of you guys to join me into the chat, which I think is a lot of fun. And I usually do that like at least every time I go live. It's a really nice way for me to basically be more personal with you guys and talk to you guys more directly. So sometimes I'll do like getting ready with me in the morning, like when I first wake up and you guys can talk to me about my day and school and I can talk to you guys about your day and whatever you guys are doing and it's a lot of fun. So I'm gonna link my you now down below in the description. Keep an eye out. If you follow me on you now, I think they give you notifications when I go live, so. The second thing I wanna talk about is... How on earth did this happen? I cannot believe this. Oh no, you guys can see how dirty my room is. Ooh, no, no, no. I'm just so thankful to you guys for this because without you guys, obviously I would never have reached 100,000 subscribers. It's so crazy. And I just wanna say, I'm so thankful that you guys actually enjoy my content enough to keep watching. And YouTube has just become the most fun thing in the world for me. I just get so excited thinking about video ideas and things I wanna do. Ooh, it's reflecting on my face. <laughs> it's so shiny. I just wanna thank you guys so much for this. This is all thanks to you and I'm ever so thankful that I've actually reached this milestone. All that aside, let's begin with the video. The video is actually sponsored by Unzi Store, so thank you very much to Unzi Store for sponsoring this video. All of the items were sent from them and they sent me some very, very cute clothes. It is an honest review though. I have told them that I will be 100% honest. There are some things where I'm like, hmm, but most things I was generally really quite happy with. So I'm going to link everything down below and you guys can have a look and see if you wanna buy any of the clothes that I wore. <laughs> Let's begin. Okay, so this is the first outfit that I'm gonna show you and the part that I was most excited about was this little vest top. Let me show you the details, it's so adorable. Do you see these little cherry details? I just think they're perfect. And then as well as it being red, it's also made of a bit of a thicker material than most vests tend to be. So I think it's a lot better for the cooler weather. So this is from Unzi Store and I also got this necklace from Unzi Store. I actually specifically got this necklace because when it becomes colder, when it gets colder I do tend to wear like turtlenecks and vests or like dresses and things like that and so I decided that this necklace would be quite cute because it's not too long and it's not too short it fits perfectly between the space that would have otherwise been kind of empty yeah so I got it specifically for turtleneck outfits this skirt is actually also from Unzi store but I got it to match another little top but I thought it actually worked quite well with this outfit as well in general, this skirt, oh my gosh, I'm actually so happy with the skirt. I know it's technically part of another outfit, but I'll just talk about it now, I guess. The skirt I'm really happy with because it's really hard for me to find skirts that fit me as well as this. They did have different sizes. I think it was like XS to L or something like that, but I'm not sure, so don't quote me on that. But this skirt, it just fits me so well. It's also got like a bit of, whoops. <laughs> it's also got a bit of stretch at the back for when I eat a lot of Korean chicken. <laughs> and I also really like the length and the color. So this skirt is definitely one of my favorite things that I got from this. Also this vest. So maybe this outfit is like the ultimate outfit. <laughs> I'm definitely gonna be wearing turtlenecks and berets quite a lot this autumn season. I feel like that's kind of the vibe that I'm going for this autumn. But yeah, I thought this was a cute and colorful little outfit. <laughs> okay, so I thought it would only be natural to then wear the top that is actually supposed to go with the skirt, which is this top. I think this is a really, really cute look, and I also feel like it's a really versatile look, because now I'm wearing it with the same turtleneck and necklace as I was wearing it before, but I feel like if I didn't wear it with this, like I could totally wear this even in spring and things like that, and make it a bit of a saucy look instead of a little cozy look. I kind of got Halloween vibes from this, I guess just because it's dark. So I decided to wear these bat ears with it, which I thought was really cute. It felt like quite a spicy outfit. This top, I'm gonna show you a little bit closer up. This top actually zips at the front, so you can just, oh, that was a bit saucy, sorry about that. <laughs> but what I like about it is it kind of cups my non-existent boobs and make me look like I have a bit more of a figure than I do. The straps are also adjustable, so you can make them longer or shorter, and it also has showering at the back. 
So I feel like this is a good outfit for like, because both of the top and the bottom are showing, you can wear this to a party and just eat your heart out. <laughs> okay, I will say this next item, I was a little bit iffy about when I first got it out of the packet because it's so huge and I was just like, how is this gonna fit on me? This is gonna look ridiculous. Not only that, but this was kind of a last minute item that I added to my cart. It wasn't something that I was really excited about. The truth is, for some reason or another, I couldn't tell you why, I'm afraid of brown. <laughs> Have you noticed that I basically never wear brown? I'm like scared to wear brown, but it's such an autumnal color and I love it on other people. I just don't get why I never wear it myself. So because of that, I decided that I would get this jacket and um, at first when I took it out of the packet, I was a bit iffy, obviously because of the size. And then I put it on and I was like, wait, I actually like it. Like, I like this whole like, I'm so small ooh, ooh, kind of look it gives me. It also has kind of an, I'm gonna go to Starbucks and get a pumpkin spice kind of vibe. Like, just real cozy. Like, I'm gonna sit there with my coffee like this and look out the window. Okay, so as you can see, I also got this beret with it. I'm actually really, really feeling berets. I think I already said that. So because of that, I have so many berets. But what I like about this one is, as you can see, there's little like flowers and stuff coming down the sides. And then there's this little bow. I actually got this in two colors because I really really like the design at the back it also has a little bow I just thought it was adorable and as I said I am trying to get into wearing brown more so I decided to be brave and get the brown one okay so I just want to say I'm so sorry that I'm literally wearing a turtleneck with all these outfits that's ridiculous I'm so sorry about that I'm just genuinely really feeling this turtleneck like everything I'm seeing I'm like oh I should wear it with the turtleneck so Guess this is really just a 10 ways to style a turtleneck outfit in the end. This outfit is this turtleneck, obviously, with jeans and this little lacy top that I got from Unzi store. Um, this has such a like 90s older sister who's too cool for you kind of vibe. That's truly the vibe I'm getting from this. I've always been the kind of person who likes lingerie like stuff being worn on top of things like this. So it's a look that I'm really feeling. It also makes me look long. I look very long right now. It's a really, really casual outfit, but at the same time, it does look like I've actually put in effort, which is a look that I really like. Yeah, just a casual look with jeans and a turtleneck. Oh man. Okay, moving on from the turtleneck, here's this next outfit, which is a little bit more of a cutesy pink kind of vibe. I feel like all the other ones so far have been quite neutral colors or red, like very autumnal colors. But I decided to get this cardigan, which I actually kind of love. It's got this little raccoon here, and it also has a little raccoon tail. So this is some details I really, really like about the cardigan. And I also really like the color. This really, really, I feel like it's the perfect very very pale pink because sometimes you can get it's a little bit too pink do you know what i mean but this is a little bit more muted which i do like however one thing i don't like is i don't like the sleeve length now i actually have really long arms i didn't even know i had really long arms until i had my teacher measure my arms basically when i first started my course we had to like measure all of our body parts so that we knew what size clothes we wanted to make and my teacher measured my arm just to double check that i'd done it right and she was like you've got really long arms. And ever since then, I've just been like, I have really long arms. I really like it when sleeves come to like here, but a lot of cardigans that you buy in these Asian stores, they do stop like here or sometimes like up here, which at least it's not that. This is wearable. But because of that, I decided to roll up the sleeves just because I don't like this awkward length. It also makes your hand look really big or it looks makes my hand look really big. Maybe I just have big hands, who knows? But yeah, so I decided to wear this rolled up. At least then it doesn't it doesn't seem as obvious. Another thing is it originally actually came with this other blouse and I don't know what it is about this blouse but I just, I don't love it. I didn't expect it to come with this blouse though so I wasn't like, oh no, the blouse came bad. I was just like, oh, it came with this blouse that I don't like. I might just ask my friends and see if any of them like it. Otherwise, I'll just donate it. I don't know what it is about it. I feel like I don't like this cat thing and I don't like the shape of it. I don't know, I just prefer like a nice regular blouse, I really wasn't feeling this. But since I wasn't expecting it to come with the blouse, I am quite happy with the cardigan itself. I think it's very, very cute. I also got this skirt from Undy Store. Now, it's very short, and I'm not sure how I feel about that. I feel like it's fine. <laughs> I can't decide if it's too short for me, like am I getting too old for this? I don't know. I I, I'm fine with it, like it doesn't bother me, but I don't know. It does fit really well at the waist though. 
So I'm quite happy with that, which is actually why I got it. I wanted like, I, I don't know what it is about me with pleated skirts and plaid skirts. Um, I'm just such a sucker for them, like in every season. And this, this can also be worn in spring, I feel like. So yeah. I got another one. Then there's also this beret. It's the same beret as before, but in pink. I actually feel like the pink one is nicer than the brown one. I really like it. Okay, so this next outfit, I can't tell if I like or not. There's a few things that I'm not sure about. First of all, this here is obviously made for someone quite a bit bustier than me. So maybe if you're a busty girl and you struggle to find things that fit you, this would be quite nice. As far as I go, I am flat as a board, so this does not work out great for me. But at the same time, it does show a lot of collarbone when I wear it loosely like this, so maybe I like it. I don't know, you guys. Can you guys tell me in the comments what you guys think about this top? I think it's quite cute. Um, the skirt is as normal as a pleated skirt goes. It's a little bit thin. I would say and it's a little bit loose on me but then that is completely my fault because obviously I saw the sizes and I picked this one so usually when something is loose to me I'll just wear like a belt tightly around the waist and I think it works completely fine I think I do like the top <laughs> I think I like it but I would probably wear it with like jeans or something and then I would probably like it more and I'd also probably wear it with like a bra that doesn't reveal everything because it would just be too easy for someone to see too much. <laughs> I think this is like a six out of 10 for me. I can't decide if I like it or not. Okay, next we've got this red dress made of this quite flowy material, which I thought would be quite nice for like autumn parties or even like for Christmas parties. I thought it was quite cute for. I really like red dresses and I feel like it really like works with my skin color. You also tie it by yourself at the back. Um, Yeah, I really like it. The only thing is it's really like loose here. I feel like, again, this was made for someone who's a bit bustier than me, so if you're busty, this could work for you, I guess. Um, I think it's going to be really easy for me to just take it in, though, if I just, ta-da, problem solved. So I think I'm just going to take it in here myself, and then, like, it's fine. Yeah, I specifically got this because I thought it would be quite nice for celebrations and things like that, um, but you could <coughs> wear it with a turtleneck under and then have it as a casual outfit. But I'm not going to show you that because you're probably sick of the turtle leg already. Psych, she's back. <laughs> Top nine pranks of 2019. Um, no, that's pretty much it for today's video. I had a lot of fun trying on clothes with you guys and playing dress up as nine year old me would have very much liked to. Let me know in the comments which outfits you liked best and which ones you didn't like as much. I would very much like to hear your opinions. And let me know how you're getting into the autumn mood. Definitely check out Anzi's store. I'm going to link all the items I got in the description for you. And that is all for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe. Thank you. Bye.